Hi, I'm Wayne Marshall. I'm conducting the Orchestra de Paris this week in a programme of music by George Gershwin. Well, the story for me, I suppose, began when I was eight years old. That's the beginning of it. And I heard a performance of the piano concerto. I'd, I'd never heard anything like it. And um, I wanted to, to get the score. Um, I couldn't read music then, but you know, I wanted to have the score of this, of this piece. Uh, of course, the piano concerto then led to me discovering more or less everything else about George Gershwin. Of course, I discovered the orchestral music, the other piano pieces. And then in 1986, um, I was working at Glyndebourne Opera in England uh, on his great opera, Porgy and Bess. It was my, really my first time working in an opera house. Um, I was repetiteur, and also I was the onstage pianist, Jasbo Brown, which plays at the very beginning of the opera. It wasn't long until I then conducted my own performance, uh, production, and of course, this work I've conducted quite a few times, and the orchestral works I've conducted many times, and played and directed the piano and orchestral pieces many times too. So he's a composer who's very, very true to my heart. Well, this is a very, this is a very interesting question. Now, I'm very fond of the music of Stevie Wonder, and um, again, he was a, a guy who really influenced my, or really changed my direction musical direction, I suppose, in the, the late 70s when I was at school in Manchester. And I heard uh, his album Songs in the Key of Life. And, it, you know, it was like a, like a bolt of lightning. You know, I was so fascinated with this, this sound world, you know, soul and funk and all of that, of that era, the music of Stevie Wonder uh, was fascinating. And, that, you know, one, one thing I would really would love to do would be to have someone arrange all of the... Um, all of the, the whole album, Songs in the Key of Life, for orchestra, and have Stevie Wonder there playing with his band. So, you know, kind of symphonic wonder. You know, I, the, the idea of this really appeals to me, of, you know, making an orchestral version out of this great genius's um, music. When I was at school, I was um, listening to uh, a record of this American virtuoso organist, Virgil Fox. And uh, I was quite overwhelmed by this playing of uh, Symphony No. 2 by Louis Vierne, French organ organist and composer. I mean, I'm an organist, so up until this point, I mean, I'd never heard this kind of organ play. Very virtuosic, very personal, fantastic uh, use of the organ. Likewise, I could say that Andre Previn, he was the person who I saw playing the Gershwin Piano Concerto on TV when I was very young, and playing and conducting this. I mean, it was amazing seeing this guy, you know, playing and getting up and conducting. I thought, no, I didn't really think of conducting at that point, but it certainly, you know, his, his performance certainly had a great effect on me um, as, a, as a conductor and, and pianist in this repertoire. Mm -hmm. 